I'm Lynn Evans and I'm head teacher of Springfield School in Portsmouth and today we're expecting Professor Brian Cox who's attending our school to give the Big Bang Lecture to my Year 11 children who have a particular interest in science and engineering. For some reason I always wanted to be a scientist in some, of some sort. I was, I was kind of interested in astronomy when I, when I was little as far back as I can remember. I was interested in space exploration. The key thing is to realise that it's something that you can do. You, you don't have to be you know, Einstein. You don't have to be a, a, a genius to do it. Like having uh, visitors like Brian, it just really makes you think how lucky we are. And I just, when you have visitors and they say more and they know more about what they know, and it just makes it a funner experience and people are so excited about it. When you're excited, you just want to learn more. Yeah, I'm genuinely um, impressed about that with, well, the enthusiasm that you all have in this school for, for science. So it's going to be a pleasure to chat to you today. So I think we're in, a, we're in a golden age of two things now. We're in a golden age of cosmology, of understanding this story that I told you, which is very, very recent about the origin and evolution of the universe, and probably a golden age of looking for life on other planets. In the next few years, we're going to send missions to Mars to look directly for life on Mars. And then perhaps in the next few decades, we're going to send missions to look for life on the moons of Jupiter. So whilst we don't have an Apollo program and a moon landing, we do have actually scientifically things that are significantly more interesting than that. So just one child in the audience that makes their mind up that you know perhaps didn't really know whether science was for them and just thinks you know what I think I think I'll just pay attention <laughs> I'll do my I'll, I'll pay you know do my lessons and then I'll go on to university and do physics or chemistry or engineering or maths you know that that's worth it and if it's more than one then superb well I thought about being an engineer maybe a scientist I think that might be an interesting career but probably an engineer to um probably like fix like airplanes and stuff and just like um, stuff I do like space shuttles. I'm interested in chemistry because I just think it's like really fascinating like how things like can react to each other and that everything in the world is made up of it. Professor Brian Cox is quite inspirational. I, mean, I know he's turned quite a few people to look at, take a different point of view to science. Uh, I, I was already going to do something with science myself further on but I think he's given me more of a push to try and do that. It's been genuinely great to be at Springfield School here. I have met so many, literally hundreds of young people who are fascinated by science. And I, I think I've met hundreds of future scientists and engineers, which I, yeah, I genuinely wasn't expecting that. It's been a wonderful experience. And I hope to see you all at the Big Bang Fair in March next year in London. Come to the Big Bang Fair in March!